What are the parts of a micrometer? Study the image until you are confident you know each of the parts. It will help you with the next text. Place the objects to be measured between the measuring faces, the anvil and the spindle, to measure them. Place means to put something in a special place or position. The anvil is the stationary measuring face. The threaded spindle is the moving measuring face of the micrometer. Stationary means it does not move. Threaded means it is cut to allow a screw to move or tighten. Hold the parts against the stationary anvil until the spindle touches the work. The scale on the sleeve of the micrometer is the instrument's primary measuring scale. The sleeve scale added to the thimble scale shows the measurement. instrument is a tool that is used for doing something. The first important number of a measurement is on this scale. It is the first value immediately to the left of the thimble. Immediately with no object or space in between. The secondary measuring scale, the thimble scale, provides the two remaining important figures of a measurement. Remaining means something not done yet. Figure is a number that shows the value or total. This part of the measurement is the value on the scale that aligns with the zero line on the sleeve scale. A line means two or more things in a straight line. When you turn the thimble, the spindle rotates and adjusts the distance between the measuring faces of the micrometer. Rotate means to turn in a circular direction. Distance is the length or space between two things. Some micrometer thimbles have a friction drive. This allows for a more exact reading. Friction is when two things rub against each other. A drive is something that gives power or energy for movement. To allow for means to make something possible. A ratchet speeder increases the speed of the spindle rotation the space between the anvil and the spindle reduces quicker 
than if you only use the thimble. Increase means to make bigger or faster. Reduce means to make smaller or slower. Using the ratchet speeder reduces the time it takes to use the micrometer. A ratchet. A ratchet is a part of a tool or machine that has movement in one direction. Normally it has a wheel with teeth and a bar that it can lock onto. The ratchet prevents over tightening. This helps to have an even measuring force to the spindle. Prevent means to stop something happening. Over tighten means to make something so tight it can't move or will break. Even means in equal value. A locking nut holds the spindle in place. You can remove the micrometer from the workpiece and look at the measurement. A locking nut stops movement or something becoming loose. Remove means to take away from a place. Workpiece is the part that is being made or worked on. Some micrometers have a lock nut and others have a locking lever. The U-shaped frame is firm and rigid. It supports the anvil and the sleeve of the micrometer. Firm is something that is solid or hard. Rigid is something stiff and cannot change the shape. Support in this case means to hold in place. The user holds the frame and takes the measurement. Take the measurement. In English, this means to measure something and record it or write it down. 